Welcome to another lesson in our Windows Server 2025 series. In this video, we will look at the system requirements to install and run Windows Server 2025. Understanding the minimum and recommended requirements helps to ensure a smooth deployment and budget performance. To get started, here are the minimum hardware requirements. You'll need at least a 1.4 GHz 64-bit processor, 512 megabytes of RAM for server core, or 2 gigabytes if you're using the desktop experience. A minimum of 32 gigabytes of disk space is required, though more is recommended for updates and features. For better performance, Microsoft recommends a multi-core 2 gigahertz processor, 8 to 16 gigabytes of RAM, and SSD storage if possible. These specs are ideal for running roles like Active Directory, DNS, file services, and light virtualization. Some features like secured core server and certain security enhancements require secure boot and TPM 2.0. If you're planning to use Azure features or remote activation, make sure the server has internet access. You should also plan hardware around the specific roles your server will host. To summarize, Always compare your hardware with both the minimum and recommended specs before installing. Think ahead about what the server will do, whether it's running VMs, file shares, or acting as a domain controller, and size accordingly. In the next video, we'll walk through the actual installation process.